We are on day 24 from the start, coming towards the end of our of the time in Oman. All well after a tricky start. Um, there is uh, uh, unforeseen uh, problems. On the first phase in Salah's demotion, we pretty much lived by just dates and gares, which is this bread dough, dates, oil, bit of honey, and whatever hospitality. We've been, there's been a lot of traditional Bedouin hospitality. For every few days, you know, some village would put on a feast for us. So that's how we sort of lived that, that first part. In the real, uh, the, the, the sands, it's been a lot more tricky because there's, no, there's, there's nothing here. So we've had to take more supplies. So we've got um, uh, seven camels which were selected for us. And these are top camels. Um, even so, you know, they're probably not used to traveling these sort of distances. Uh, we've been pushing them, you know, up to 11 hours a day traveling. They've got tired as well. It's one of the lessons I've learned about that camels, we think they can go forever, no food, no water, and it's not true. Well, pretty much every day they need food and water. We could last a couple of days, um, but uh, three days you'll be pushing it. I think the highlights has been the, the hospitality, the culture and heritage of the region of the Bedouin here in the Etsy Quarter. You know, this has been brought together due to the, the kind sponsorship of Abu Dhabi Culture and Heritage. It is about the culture and heritage um, of the region, the history, you know, it's about the history of Thessalonica and Milk Wilbur Thessalonica. Just thought it would be a great, great thing to try and recreate, to try and do something in in his footsteps. I and mean, I think he, what he did was pretty remarkable. And I think one lessons I've learned from having done this on this modern day trip is even more respect for what he managed to do. You know, the limited supplies of water, of food, of the terrain. It's easier today. We're looking forward to um, a great welcome in the Emirates um, when we when we cross over, especially obviously with the National Day, 40th anniversary National Day coming up. But I think looking forward to the hospitality on the way as we do what is quite a long leg, Umza Moor to Liwa, up to Alain and back to Abu Dhabi. It's, it's, a, it's a good uh, 17 days or so. Any encouragement is always welcome. We'll publish the route and uh, they're very welcome to, to, to come and give us a cheer.